so they can get the opening kill to get into the fight, and that's a good way to get started. Oh, Stewie taking shots and a double kill already. He's got him isolated in the corner, but Olaf Meister fighting his way out, and then comes the return. Double kill for Olaf. Rain and Cold Sierra, they chime in, and suddenly it's a round one for FaZe. So initial oh, no. retake was looking pretty good, but... 20 seconds, so they actually have to show up. I mean, they could maybe try and go up the vent, but that is so dangerous. Grim is going to be here picking up the AK. 14 seconds on the clock. They need that bomb plant right now. If anyone stops them in this uh, plant, it's going to be a nightmare. A little bit of a grenade to try and slow it down. And that'll actually almost take out Fallen. The lack of armor and that nade does 85 damage. So suddenly, it's a 2 on 3, and FaZe can absolutely win this round. Twist, good little kill. Naf actually wins the battle against him. That's a bit interesting. Olaf, now, they're very low on health, but he's out in the open, and he does get back around the corner. I thought he was going to get shot in the back. Naf has got one health, and he's got no kit, obviously, so it's going to be tricky to try and defuse this for 10 seconds. Now, he's going to go straight onto it, and Olaf, he'll just take a little bit of a shoulder peek. He's looking for him. Three seconds still, and plenty of time for Olaf to find him, so it will be the round here. Nice triple for Olaf, and a second round for FaZe, albeit they can take it to Yard, they can go in Earth, they, they, they've got uh, a deep enough yeah, um, strat book on T side nuke to be a threat here. And so, yeah, there's a leash, a little bit of a poke, and that sets it up for Fallen outside. Nice follow up! Name your bomb. Right? Well, there you go. There we go. Seventh round, Stewie, pretty aggressive position here, but he's got the AK-47. That helps so much if you want to make that kind of a play for Naf as well. And they line up, and Stewie crunching in behind them. And he just, he's not even afraid of, of a fourth person being there. Oh, dear. I'm just gonna say, Liquid, I mean, from having one round last time, whew, the the improvement is really dramatic, you know? Uh, this is like old nuke right now. It's like, okay, cool, the T-side, they got the pistol landers, awesome. That's now they got those get. three rounds, and now they just need to get like two more, and they're gonna be feeling really good about this half. As far as Nap is concerned, I guess he just got bored and wanted to get in the fight a little bit here. Good on him. Being proactive. Oh, here we go. The vet dive is at least attempted. Elige, the element is the grim with the Molotov. I'd love to see. Is that down at the bottom or is he running through the squeak door? It's not really clear, but regardless, a lot of death happening in the attempt to get that bomb down. And it's just not even close. And look at all of them. Oh, no. They paved their way with corpses instead of pavement, Samla. Just... It's gonna be it's gonna be like light on the knees, you know, to run. Yeah. Ooh, Olaf Meister though. He ate that HE though, so let's see. Stu's gonna rotate over though, and as the smoke goes down, it should be fairly quick. Uh Liquid's just doing a really good job of reading the economy. No, maybe not. Maybe not. Nice little shot there. Taking down Rain. Another early good start. He actually sees him, and Twist is very low on health. And Stewie, he gets that cold, and he knows that someone is there. Molotov comes in next, but Elige helping. So now Stewie doesn't have to worry about Mini any longer. Smoke is up. He didn't realize there's already someone through, so he's very exposed. All of Meister, great follow-up. What a double kill. That brings it back into a three-on-three. -three. He does get tagged a bit low and grim from the high ground. Brokey shooting straight up, and just like that, it's a one-on-two. Nap out in the open. He's going to get both the kills somehow. What an absolute seesaw round. It was just all over the place. He uh, took a little bit of... I think he wanted to keep an eye on it from the other side this time. They're at secret, but... It's just Nuke. You look at the big map on Nuke. You think he's in Yard? No. That's how it is. He's in, the, he's in a tunnel under Yard. That is how it is. 30 seconds on the clock. That's a bit scary, but we know where they're going now. I mean, the bomb is up here. They're going to be wrapping around through Mini, Fallen getting a kill, but this is the main push, and Twist, that entry is huge. 20 seconds, and Grim, not sure where to look, Twist, running onto the site. That's how we saw him yesterday, Twist, just lightning fast with those headshots, and yeah, they can't stop him. A triple kill for Twist so far, all of them headshots, and Nap will have to make his escape, so again, quite low on time, potentially a little bit scary. But they've been making it work phase, so classic execute you could do on the T side. You've got one guy lurking around the back, you know, around lobby. All of my is actually going to join them a little bit late outside, but he could have just as well been in lobby. Um, and just to try and catch and make sure no CTs are sneaking up behind them. And then the rest go for the site down here at the B-bomb site, where currently, well, it's just Naf holding. And he is very exposed up here. Getting a double kill. I mean, we've seen it before, but you could also just go straight down. Nili is just going to get dropped. He was out in the uh, garage outside. Fallen, though. Yeah, it's a good angle. But now he's got some some attention. And Naf is going to get just flashed out of this position and found by a twist. Another really cool and crisp entry for him. Wow, yeah, they're getting absolutely shut down. Not even close. Wrecked.
Like that's that's all I'm thinking right now is that they just got utterly picked apart. They're gonna have to shut down the just the focus and the power behind phase here. And winning a second round is always a good way to get there. Olaf diving back in. <laughs> in between. Oh, he turns. Nearly a double. I can't believe he gets anything at all. I thought he was going to be dead for sure. The second he just he, he turned that railing, I thought it was going to be over. Now, they put down those Molotovs instantly. I don't blame them. They want the bomb plant. But it means they have nothing left now for the after plant. And this is going to be a long after plant. Phase, on the other hand, they have a lot of nades. They can cover this entire bomb site in smokes and just try and make sure they can get in. Stewie going to turn for the nade. Hopefully, someone's covering his back. A little bit of action there. Fallen dropping low. And they don't even check it. Naf with a headshot as well. And now, it's going to be over for Phase. They really needed that strong entry. Stewie with the triple. We were, we were talking about him earlier. Hiding his head. But um, this round is good. <laughs> Liquid just taking their time. Picture perfect CS coming in here from Liquid. Real death ball approach. When you're dealing with anti-ecos and you have rifles, this is really the name of the game. Just stick together. Put yourself in positions to trade. So that you don't get picked off one after the other by deagles. Oh, rain. <laughs> they were almost out of the woods. They almost had it. But um, not quite. Rain will go down eventually. And now Brokey, 16 seconds. So even if he got the kill there on the guy with the bomb, he was he was not going to win the round. He's not even going to actually fall back. He's just hanging out here. That's pretty bold again. Oh, I see. He sets a smoke up. So this is with 49 seconds of smoke going up over here. It's really painful. Oh, my though. What? <laughs> what was that? Oh, no he's way. doing it again. He's not even going to be falling back. That is such, such a gross shot, isn't it? Oh, dude, it's as if he's just, you just don't want to see it. Don't keep playing CS, Olaf, please. Yeah. Can we petition him? Yeah, can we petition him? Can we do something like, because, dude, this whole series, like, all group long, he's been doing great. He's had, like, those flashes of brilliance. Oh, okay. Stewie's trying right. to do some more damage. Oh, this is actually like a reverse, isn't it? This is where FaZe should just be winning outright with no casualties, and now instead, they're losing more. Stewie is backfighting. He can't win the round. It's so tragic because he doesn't have the time for it. He's just running around the corner, and it's going to be in the corner. Twist to take him down, but that is finally... Finally, FaZe get a taste of that, where they, you know, they had the round Im immediately, but this is... <laughs> what even is that? The corner with the AWP, but if they go out here... If they win one fight, this round is over, almost certainly. If they end up... left, though, Anders. Oh, yeah. 20 seconds, that's actually a good point. Let's see, here we go. Twist, he's going to get rewarded. A lot of patience. He's been waiting here the whole round. Nap is up next, and he still wins the fight. He actually looked away. 10 seconds on the clock. A little bit of a Molotov to slow them down. They're going to get a couple there, and now it's rain alone. How do they turn it? It's a headshot for Malige, and it will be the round for Liquid. It looked unwinnable, especially with the Molotov down in front. And actually, FaZe didn't do much. But they've given the, they throw it early enough where Team Liquid can actually still have a bit of room to maneuver with here. 40 seconds on the clock now. And so they are going to have to decide to well, hold on now. You see, Fallen, I think Fallen might throw the same Molotov again. And in that case, Brokey can't put it out. Yep. So if he does that one more time, well, let's just see what happens. 30 seconds. There's the grenade coming in, and it just it forces him back. He has to play in that corner. Flashes are all over the place, and Liquid, they can't make their way through. Rain with a big double kill, and cold up here. He snags a kill. That's all we needed. And Fallen, he can't make his way through. One versus four. Going to try and see if he can find some a little bit more damage, do something at the end here, but he backs on out. It is a cool idea, and actually everything looked like it was lined up well for Liquid. The Molotovs and the flashes on top, but once they couldn't get out of Squeak... And again, the critical detail, can they win this round without losing, you know, two or three people? They're in a 5 on 3, so it should be totally doable. Olaf is in the right position, a little bit of a spring, he actually did miss part of it, but he'll make up for it with a nice triple shutdown. It's a perfect round. Ooh. I mean, it can work. They're going to be down there. Molotovs all across the board. Stewie in with the opening, and that's a big one. And in the corner, they find Twist, but they can't take him down. What a double. And Rain following it up and dropping Naf. This is absolutely huge. Alige, he's trying to bang it back. They nearly lined up. And Olaf, he's going to catch him, no problem. 15 rounds on the board for FaZe. You know, more life uh -huh. loses the... Okay. 
I would just shoot the AK Bouncer Candy, but... Oh, here we go! Grim trying to get the opening. It's, that's a cool attempt. The timing was incredible, but the spray did not follow up. And now there is a bit of a lobby crunch coming up behind them. It's just trading all over the place, and it's a three-on-three, three, but they are taking a lot of damage inside of that Molotov. Elige, I can't believe he wins that fight! And the follow-up! A triple kill on Elige. Low on health, he should... He had no business! being even close to winning that round. And yet, here we are, tied with Olaf Meister, both at 32 kills. So FaZe absolutely need this win here on Nuke. He died in the window down there in the last round, the last kill, and he looked like he was posing. That's interesting. Stewie, oh, that was the same play that Rain made last time where he got the quad kill, but this time he gets shut down, and Grim and Naf are behind them. Elige with the AWG helping out, and they shut it down and get it right into double overtime. Stewie goes down, though. Brokey with one more opening, and twist on the crossfire. This is looking brilliant. Five versus two, and Naf and Grim... They just cannot get it done. I mean, they had some deep nades, but they didn't have the wall that was blocking things off, right? And as a result, yeah, they just get pinned out, especially by that AWP. Brokey, I mean, again, numbers, not the best that we've seen, but some very important rounds where he's the one opening it up. So what a battle this has been. Grim, you know, one versus five. He's going to go and put the bomb down. He's created a bit of space with the smoke, but he needs some massive mistakes out of phase. I mean, really huge here for this to even be doable. Rain, and then the follow-up is there, and it will be phase to pick up the map 22 to 20. And that is a really, really long battle that they had to fight to get there. But what an amazing way to get the series started, and it's only the first map. We've still got Inferno coming up. I can't wait.